seconds remaining. Yeah, the other thing is you have to know, this is Ice Ice Ice. He's the key player for Faceless. Look when he this. has a good game, things go well. Deep play on the bottom lane. Faceless hunting for Universe. TP reaction will be coming through from Zai. Face is very deep here on this bottom lane between Escape the two and the tier up. two. X yeah, X Y. He's going to be taken down here. Zai will help the turnaround. Definitely one of the upsides of picking this dream protector, and why it will probably be one of the top picks here. Bottom lane again. The roll will miss, but they do connect the boulder smash this time. They may be successful with the frostbite, bringing Zai down low. Try and come in with the shockwave, and they do get the kills. <laughs> Managing to get himself in position at the last moment. Sunstrike in return, though. Samael. The tier one mid tower there, if they knew he was alone. They don't, that's the, the thing. If they went on oh, here. Oh, it's easy. Gets RP, skewered under the tower. Nuts is there for the follow through control, but Samael, he's going to come in and try his best to save Artor with a living armor as well on the clinks. Artizi trying to get himself out of here, but he's been boulder smashed. XY with a beautiful stun and silence onto both Artizi and Samael. Sets up for a second. Black doing what he can to try and find trades in the map, but could get punished. Lane. Yeah, some with the set. There's a BKB and an Aegis on Black. We'll see if they can pop either of them. Zai looking to move into position on the back lines, but already the sentry is down quickly with the silence, making sure that there's no no chance of Zai throwing out anything in this fight. The force out the BKB charge. The but triple sentry line in mid. <laughs> oh, bottom lane, look at this. Jab looking to set up for a skewer, and indeed, Universe sent back into the clutches of Ice Ice Ice. Universe still tries to TP, isn't going to quite make it. I'll take down the Nature's Prophet, mid lane, Samael, Boulder Smash, could be in trouble here. Nuts with the control, allowing Black to get in close to personal with the Freezing Field as well. Faceless, they get another kill. Not sure if that's something, I feel like Faceless just have to invest in that. They're being split pushed to Whoa, death right jump now. Jumping onto Samael, Boulder Smash, catching the two cores, but the Shackle Shot, quick in reaction onto the Earth Spirit. The Force Back, Samael turns around with the Meteor, Black, no BKB, Post the Manta, has to get himself back up the high ground, the Overgrowth there. Samael and Arteezy moving forward, the Power Shot, bring them down low, but the Force Black out to safety. Jabs, jump forward, gets the BKB skewer onto Samael, putting him back into the hands of Black, another Tornado sending Black up. Samael, can he get out? He might be able to know. The Spiders bring him down. They found Samael, but they've lost Black. They've lost XY, Arteezy, BKB, mans up to jabs, takes the Magnus out, now down for 80 seconds. Tornado thrown in by Samael, won't clip onto Nuts, but they've cleared the space open on this bottom lane. They've taken the tier three, Arteezy alacritied up, turns towards the racks with the treant backup of Universe, and they will clear out this bottom lane. This here is there, but it's a lane oh, where you've already lost racks. got eyes on Arteezy here, holding the gem, jumps in, there we have it. Arteezy dragged back, can they bring him down in time before he's Great able jackal. to get the BKB or get himself out? He'll pop the cheese, Arteezy still alive, there's the buyback from Troll. Artor now pops the BKB, turns towards Jabs, Black comes in, gets the bash, they've got the control onto Arteezy, they'll bring him down. Did cost the buyback control, but they'll get rid of the cling. Samael trying to go for the split up top, buying up potential RPs. Again, looking towards them. Oh, that's a good RP. That's a very good RP. Catches two. Post the refresher. Oh, he's not got mana for the second RP. He refreshes and walks home. They will pop the ages. He's got it soon. He's almost got mana for it. Okay. Can he get it off? There's the second BKB charge. RTZ looking to focus for the Megas. We'll get it. Nice skewer back. Where's the RP? There it is. We'll catch our tour, but not Samael. They have the freezing field. The bashes as well. RTZ's down. Samael, cross the refresher. The second BKB charge, but the bash is coming through from Black. He'll get the disarm off. Samael trying to walk himself away. EMP is going to bring them down with the tornado combo as well. Faces have got to be careful. Samael trying his best to do it, but the Dagon 5 comes in and hits hard. Isn't going to latch. Jabs tries yeah. to jump forward, but the skewer won't grab him. Abazai. Should be in trouble here. They have the vision. Chase him into the, in the screen line. And yeah, the base potentially in trouble here. Oh, he didn't get the BKB off. Arteezy will hex up Ice Ice Ice, but Ice 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 now gets the chance to BKB. Turns towards Arteezy. The rest of faces are coming in. RTZ into the tree line, trying to hide. XY has found him, but the BKB is out from Artor. XY looks for the rollaway. Somehow manages to survive. Jabs. Can he find something big with this RP? He's looking at Universe. We'll be able to skewer him back. They need the damage to come from someone. Ice 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 will surround him. Dagon onto XY blows him up. There's your RP. It's only going to catch Universe. The second one, though, will get RTZ the bigger target. RTZ falling low, but Samael's there to cover his back. Comes in with a three-man tornado. Buyback from Black. They're looking towards the Ancient. The Fortify's already been used. EG, finally, just before the 60-minute mark, are able to close off the game as uh, that was one of the longest holes we've seen in a while with Mega Creatures. Faceless tried their best. Thank it a little. Anti -mage. Anti -mage. Totally wrong as far as Faceless's laning stage objective. They didn't try and secure any early souls there, but they're going to get first blood top. Nice move from from Nuts. This will be close. Yeah, well, Universe coming through as well. They should be able to control them. There's the first silence. Crit will have the... Uh, 
the follow through for Spy to try and catch him mid timber chain and indeed they will. They'll bring some mail through as well to make sure that they can get the kill. So EG looking to form a defense here in the mid lane. Jabs actually waltzing straight they up to the high it. ground here. They're looking to finish off the tier one. They should get it, but the freezing field's been dropped. In response, great boulder smash to cancel the CM ultimate. The tower will go down. Can they get themselves out though? Zai jumps in with the dream coil. They'll try for the requiem. The frostbite's there to cancel it first off, but they'll get the second attempt on and some mail taken down as he's tossed up by Black. And, I mean, it feels like RTZ just got to make a huge blunder for EG to lose this game and Faceless have the chance to take it. First, real attempt at the high ground where there's no immediate split push threat. And they've killed CM. Okay, that's one down. Faceless, putting a heavy bit of pressure onto this tier three. Let's see what RTZ's plan is going to be. Is he going to back up and help them? The Dream Coil? No, connect the stun onto Ice Ice Ice. Being brought down fairly low. Now with the tricks of trade, trying to force faces to back up. Jabs, revving up the ultimate. Now we get the damage reduction. Not a huge amount of actual damage done by it. It's a nice portal smash onto two. RTZ blinks away. Black actually with the blink combo, able to bring down Universe. And okay, with that, Faceless will open up the potential yep. to almost certainly get these racks. The fortification will come out, but they'll stick around. And Faceless... Managing to do it here, outplaying EG in the full 5v5. Doesn't engage well into him, and again we see this problem where suddenly Faceless have lanes pushed out. And the and odds are pretty much there, I mean yeah. Chaotic offering odds. the only one lacking. Yeah, a little bit lacking, but still, I'm they've got in. the creep equilibrium in a good place. Already jabs down to less than half health here. RTZ jumps in on the back lines, goes in with the Abyssal Blade. XY hits him back with the Boulder Smash. Samael again with the burst, able to bring down the wall. Up. They'll turn towards Jabs, popping the BKB, trying to run himself away. Ice, Ice, Ice is there on the high ground. They'll the turn break. back towards RTZ. RTZ has to be careful. Is there going to be another bit of a stun coming through? They have the toss into the Boulder Smash. The silence as well. They'll bring him down once. I think they need to get out now. Yeah, he's fluttering away on the SF. Does not want to get caught by this anti mage. Can RTZ find anyone else? He's looking at jabs. That next blink could nice. just about do it. Good Hurricane Pike to push him back. Black's there with the Silver Edge touch. Zai jumping forward as well. Bottom lane, Mimo. <laughs> Samael is just styling on Ice Ice Ice. Brings the Timber Saw down. Black continuing to be chased down here. And with the Abyssal Blade, they may just get him. The Manafoy comes through. Black's out of mana. He's out of luck. He's down and out. Has got the more, probably more important level 21 for the extra damage. They've got the big ultimates. Chaotic offerings back there and available. Yep. And as you said, yeah, we saw them use it down bottom, get themselves a set of racks. So absolutely can go for it again here in the mid lane. Bloodthorn dropped onto Arteezy, forced him to back up initially. And at the same time, Samel jumping in on the backliners, trying to force Fettafel to scout it. And then Arteezy just commits here with the BKB, the Chaotic Offering coming back in return. Jabs as well, pops his BKB with the Requiem. Arteezy trying to oh, focus geez. down. Blackie's falling incredibly low, but yet the cheese comes through in time. Arteezy has to blink away. Samel will end up being able to burst down the Earth Spirit. But the only casualty so far in this fight, Nuts still alive, gets the dust out onto Zai, who tries to go for the smoke screen TP out. He's actually going to make it. Zai will live. Nuts taken down by the right click of Samel as he picks up a double. Uh, we'll see if each able to get themselves back in and abuse this. They've got their eyes onto Ice 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 at the moment. Universe, Crit, and RTZ ready to go. They'll jump straight in with the Bloodborne, Freezing Field as well. He's tanky. Is he tanky enough? Uh, with the Abyssal Blade, they'll have the control needed. He Huck will commit the suicide, and at the same time, mid in the lane. mid lane, faceless. Whoa. They made the bigger play, getting both yeah. Samael and Zai out. That was the Silver Edge initiation. Black just goes charging in with a gem in hand, and... Bang's a big kill. On XY, boulder smash onto RTZ. Do they have enough control to bring him down? XY forces away. The silence there just in time. But the Manta Star is available. Ooh, Black doesn't misses. quite get the avalanche, but he jumps forward, has the toss. There's the blood form silence as well. They'll kill RTZ. RTZ's down for 100 seconds. Crit, oh, let's say someone has to buy back. Looking Fuck to TP out. Can he get out in time? He will. We'll be able to be able to, to get back. Have potential. Maybe even taking a second set of racks. Samel with the jump in. She's looking to dag on jabs down. They're actually going to expend the anti-mage buyback here. They're worried about how much faces can get done, and they may still be able to. They'll bring the melee racks down low. Fortification comes out from EG. They get the dream cost done onto two RTZ. Abyssal Blade dropped here. The chaotic offering in response to RTZ has to be careful. He's put the BKB in the Manta. Turns towards a potentially easier target, but Ice 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 is too tanky. Black hits the combo on Universe. Universe is out. Jabs surviving with the Hurricane Pike, but Zai jumps across. Will manage to finish off the kill, but the kill back is he there lost in his return. Ages. He didn't have the... He, he lost the Aegis oh, like a good just, 
15 seconds ago. Oh, that's unfortunate really, for Jabs. Yep. That's it's one hero down. You've got yep. the numbers, and it is a hero as well that was doing a fair bit with the freezing field in these fights. I think more importantly, you're like pushing high ground, and there's no split push threat, yeah. and you're in your good position. Oh, oh, he, oh, he pistoled himself with the lower sword. Bartizzi still will be fine. BKBs and Mantis trying to finish off Jabs. Again, the uh, the Lotus sword has been laid down on Jabs, allowing him to keep himself safe. They'll kill Artizi. I might be over. He's down for 100 seconds there. That awkward initiation oh, from Artizi. No. It's over. GG is called. EG tap out. What we an are MVP going Lotus. to a game three. And just yeah. an awkward way to jump in. Yeah, the Lotus Hobbs. Who, who, was, who was that from? That was Ice Ice Ice, Ice wasn't it? The master no, no, troll no. himself. And, and just like that, bam. Storm. Storm Spirit. Whew. Charge onto Samal, making sure the Samal doesn't have any, any thoughts of going in aggressive. Oh, he's, oh, got, he's, he's got the bash. Is it going to be enough? Ooh. Not quite. There was yeah, nothing actually, missed. There luckily. was as well. <laughs> that would have brought some out down very low. X Y actually got the haste and again with another bash. Oh, X Y gets the first blood and he's going to get himself back out to safety. Nope. The early rock synergizes well oh, with meta. Black once again though on this bottom lane and uh, will catch him out. Trying to keep him alive here with the shadow word here. That's not enough. E G with the R P and the horn. Do you get the kill? Maybe even more here as Arteezy continues to chase down Nuts. And yeah, with a Crystal Nova slow from Crit coming across the tree line, they'll get it. The charge will be on Tartor under the tower, but the Frostbite holds back XY. In a live here, charge from XY. Looking for Crit. Black's there as well. Crit will hold it back with the Frostbite. They'll pop the horn here. Chaotic Offering actually dropped as well by Nuts as they're really looking to try and go in on this CM. They'll zip forward. Crit. Gets himself up to the shrine. Do they have the damage to bring him down through the regen? No, because Universe is there with the RP on to do it. The freezing field. Oh, it's a beautiful bait by Crit. Bringing faces up to this high ground. Crit, he might even survive, and he does. He walks it off. Oh, they got massively baited there, Faceless. Walking yeah. into the, the easiest RP of Universe's life. Tower down. So, I mean, that's the, the one thing Faces have going for them. They're doing a much better job, and that's the nature of their line, but taking objectives. Between the Nature's Profit and the Terra Blade, they're constantly getting oh, towers. Look at this initiation here with the charge. Though is smoke screen to stop it. Though jabs taken down by the trick. The train, the freezing field from Crip. Brilliant takes down too. What a smoke screen. That was beautiful. RP faces. They, they are going to go for a smoke. Jabs looking for the initiation straight in onto Universe, making sure it's hard for him to get off a good RP. He still gets it off, and that's going to be enough to kill the Storm Spread. Double kill for Samael as he comes through with the Sonic Wave. Crit will fall in return. Black doing quite a lot here with the Metamorphosis. A good Is it going to be enough? Falling low, but he doesn't get it off in time. He's down. Samael survives with the triple kill. RTZ still alive. Samael just cleaning up the back lines. Picks up an Ultra. He'll pick up a Tier 1 to boot as well. Samael just styling across them all. Ice 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 comes in with Jabs. They're looking for Samael. It's a huge kill if they can get it, but they can't. He blinks out Jabs. Still trying to zip and find it. Samael, will he go down? He finally does. It's a big kill to find. That's a dieback though, OD Pixel. Yeah, that and was... Jabs is probably going to go down as well as Arteezy oh, and Zai chase him down. A storm gone as well. That's seven deaths on Faceless. Sometimes, you know, the kills don't really tell the story, but this game, it certainly feels like they do. 31 to 7. And uh, the lead in terms of goals, certainly apparent as well. Zai will be going on. A quick tricks of the trade. He'll survive. And in fact, Jabs could be in trouble. The Chaotic Offering will be there to hold them back. Jabs zips back in. Again, the smoke screen still there. Has to be careful. The horn coming through. Universe in the midst of it all. The RP lands on to three. Getting faceless. Caught down. And now, as two are out, XY will charge back in. He's looking for Zai, will get the Ricky kill. But Universe again turns around with the Shockwave, picks a third. Arteezy's there to clean up a fourth. And once again, Faceless are just having to throw a full team, just getting one kill. This time, it's not even Samel, it's only poor old little Zai. <laughs> Zai feeling uh, that it doesn't really matter what he builds. I mean, I guess it, it's still kind of cool. You jump in our toy haunts around. It gives you a free taxi ride. The jump in though from Jabs. Looking to fight. They'll get the bash onto the CM. Glimmer caped up. XY looks for another strike. Yet. Universe jumps forward. Has the skewer onto uh, the Storm. And Jabs is down for 60 seconds. XY's out as well. Again, 4-5. This time the full team white. And they'll tap out. It's enough. FL, they can't take any more of this as EG win, I think, for the EG fans out there who looked at EG as probably one of the top contenders here in Kiev.